Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft series. And I'm just sort of messing around on Minecraft at the minute. But I saw a video and it inspired me a little bit. As I do, that's where I get my inspiration from, just dicking around on the internet. So I'm going to show you how to turn these two blocks into quite some fun. So, first to get set up, I'm just going to spawn a hell load of pigs here. So, back in a second. So, there's my pigs. I've managed to half my frames for a second. So I think that would be enough. And what we're going to do with this is we're going to make them go everywhere. And for any of you who want to try this, just a simple two block setup with a nice drop at the bottom. And then click here and boom! Pig cannon. And one hell of a meat for us to collect. I'm not sure if this works with other mobs. So... Well, there's a question. Let's get tested. If you need wool for your bed for that night, boom! Sheep cannon. Wool everywhere. That'll build you a whole ton of beds. Need lots of beef or leather armor? Cow cannon. And that one hit me. Ta da! This is pretty much the easiest mob cannon. And unfortunately, requires us to spawn. But I'm pretty sure someone could turn this into quite fun, you know. Spawn, 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 spawn. Quickly gonna try this with multiple mobs. See if, yep, that seems to be working. Works best with pigs. Pigs spawn the best. Everything else seems to be quite a lot slower. Here is my multi-mob cannon. Fire! Well, here's a little fun video for you all. Yeah. Let's go and loot all this stuff. And of course, my cannon my cannon platform isn't big enough to catch everyone. But yeah, you guys go try this out. And I'll see you guys next time. Well, if that isn't the coolest effect ever. Squid cannon! Wow, that didn't go very far at all. Squids do not travel as far as anyone else. But work just as well.